the truth. Hey guys, it's me, Alta, and welcome to a Team Fortress 2 commentary. Today we're going to be talking about unused, unusual effects that didn't make the final cut into the game. I'm going to be expressing my opinions and thoughts of why they aren't in the game, and make a prediction of what price they would have been at if they were added to the game. So, let's get started. The first one here is named on the wiki as superairballoon.png. Now personally, I don't really like this unusual effect, I think it looks too bland and ugly, but you may see it differently. Since it says super rare in the file name, I would say this, be a, this would be a priced around 30 to 40 keys due to it just being rare in itself. However, the effect itself brings it down by a lot, just because it just looks ugly, especially on most hats. Next up are the super rare beanie effects. These effects I also don't really enjoy. They are way too small to be seen from a distance. Not only that, some just look ugly as you can see on screen. I'd say depending on the type of beanie, it would be around 10 to 20 keys. And the reason why they aren't added is just because of how small and really insignificant they are. Here we have the A A A A A A. Wait, is that really what it's called? Damn TF team, are you out of your minds? Okay, anyways, this is a normal effect with no super in sight. And what a surprise, I don't like this effect. It just looks like achievements over and over and over again. Just imagine seeing a pyro walking around just getting achievements over and over and over again. That's just this unusual. So I would say it's like terawatt and kilowatt. It's o it's an okay low tier effect. I would say around 13 to 21 keys. And the reason why it got removed is well, the particle effect for the achievements were the same. So is it really have a point? Any point in having it as an unusual effect? No, I don't think so. Here we have the circling full cloudy moon, or something like that. This is not a super rare, which I was actually surprised at because of the cloudy moon being super rare. And well, I really like this effect. It might have been cool to see this in the game. However, due to how people see circling unusual effects, this would have been a price around 20 to 30 keys. However, I would have been happy to pay full price for it, because I really like this effect. I have no idea why it's removed. Like I said, I would love to see this in game. Next up is Stormblood. Now, I love this unusual effect. Maybe it's teen angst, but who knows, but I ain't lying. This effect looks really nice and would look awesome in game. Now, if we're talking price, I'd say around 60 to 90 keys, but maybe I'm biased towards this effect. I don't know. But I have no idea why this effect was not added. It's it is still in the files though, so maybe. Hey, TF team, maybe in the power update for this TF team. That'd be great. Bye. Now there are two unusual effects that were completely removed from the game and from the files. So unfortunately, we will not see these in game. However, personally, you may see it differently. I don't like these unusual effects. First up is Orbiting Shells, and already this is not looking great. This effect is similar to Nuts and Bolts, which you know isn't that great of an effect. So talking price wise, I would say 8 to 10 keys. And it got removed, I'm guessing, due to the similarities to Nuts and Bolts. Maybe this was going to be Nuts and Bolts, but then it got changed last minute. Who knows? All in all, not a great effect. And finally, we got Zap. And I can already see why this got removed. Now, ain't gonna lie, I kind of like this one, but not much. There seems to be way too much clipping and the effect is too big and almost too like kilowatt. Price wise, maybe scraping around 80 to 20 keys, but again, who knows. This effect could have been added if they were to make it smaller and less like kilowatt. Thank you so much for putting up for me for that video. Of course, video quality and all of that stuff will improve because, you know, this is my first video. If you did enjoy, hit that like button, it really helps the channel a lot. It helps more than you think. If you enjoy my type of content, subscribe. Always like new subscribers come to the channel. Anyways, thanks again for watching. I'll see you a lot later.